Hi, I'm Paula Hollywood, Senior Analyst at ARC Advisory Group. I have been in the process automation industry for 30 plus years. 12 of those years have been here at ARC. I'm here this morning to talk about asset performance management and in particular the plant asset management study that was recently completed. Plant asset management refers to condition-based monitoring tools for efficient, effective asset maintenance. Uh, other areas of asset performance management that I cover are reliability, which is a maintenance strategy tool for the development of physical asset performance strategies as well as to mitigate risk. ARC is a market research management consulting firm with over 50 analysts globally. We provide vision, experience, and answers for industry and infrastructure to our clients. ARC covers topics that range from enterprise software to plant floor hardware and everything in between in the process discrete and hybrid manufacturing arenas. ARC has been following the plant asset management space for 10 years. The latest study update was published in April 2012. It is based on a data year of 2011 and projects five-year forecasts through 2016. ARC studies in the asset performance management domain, in addition to PAM, includes reliability software and services, enterprise asset and field service management, and process safety systems. End users can use this information to assist with strategic supplier and technology selections. Plan asset management is really about condition-based maintenance of assets as opposed to corrective maintenance or a time-based maintenance. The primary study segmentations for PAM are hardware, software, and services. Other segmentations that are of interest are asset type, which are machinery and production assets, which includes motors, rotating and reciprocal equipment, process and mechanical equipment, remote equipment, and electrical and wiring systems. Automation assets consists of field devices, analyzers, control valves, positioners, and networks. Standard ARC study segmentations include world region, industry, sales channel, and end user type. PM technologies examined for this report include vibration, infrared thermography, ultrasonics, oil analysis, and corrosion. This study is presented in the same format as all ARC studies, which is five chapters, the first being the executive overview, which is a summary of other chapters and specific data points of interest. For example, the global revenues for PAM Solutions in 2011 was $1,965,000,000. ARC estimates this market will outpace that of process automation with a compound annual growth rate of 6.7%. Key market and technology trends are also identified here, as well as strategies for success in this marketplace for suppliers. The second chapter is the scope, which defines the markets and segmentations evaluated. Other PAM segmentations are network and communication technology, applications, be that protection or prediction, deployment type, be that online, offline, or wireless, and integration with other business systems, which include ERP, EAM, and reliability. Market shares are presented in the fourth chapter. Our PAM study analyzes 45 suppliers of PAM solutions. This chapter takes a deep dive into supplier positions in those segmentations. It provides a view of the competitive landscape and what those keys to success are for those leading suppliers. This chapter would be of particular interest to sales and marketing professionals. The market forecast would be of particular interest to business development managers. It also includes five-year forecasts of all the segmentations 
and as well as identify growth opportunities as well as obstacles to success. The supplier profiles are included in Chapter 5. The profiles provide product names, provides a brief company overview, talks about partnerships and acquisitions as well as the strengths and challenges of those suppliers. So ARC welcomes this opportunity to assist you with your PAM study needs or any other study or custom research needs. Please give us a call at 781-471-1000 or visit us at arcweb.com.